Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. It is I, Impale Dane, with another propaganda cast, the only source of propaganda ministry approved video cast for you. With a 2 versus 2 on McGehens, or McGehens, um, I have absolutely no idea how to pronounce it, honestly. All I do know is that apparently it's the name of one of the guys who made Company of Heroes, and I have no idea if they actually can also pronounce his name or what. It's a big mystery. Anyhow, this map has received some changes with this patch. In fact, it has gained a few openings in the hedgerow, so it isn't so easily blocked off as this map has some tendency, in particular with bridge, just park in the area and then lock off every entrance, thus making it very, very tiresome to actually ma move anywhere. It's a bit too easy to create a series of choke points and then just hold it off until you get something big. So let's have a look at our opponents in the southern corner. We do have, if I can find them, yes, there we go. Squee of the Panzer Elite, and we have Hideki 2006W. Yes, Hideki and Squee of the 1st SS Panzer Division, counter attacking during the Great Operation Lutich, which was sent in to sort of put a stop to Operation Cobra, which was quite wreaking havoc in the western part of northern France. And who do we have facing them? We have Cruise Time and Engineer ICE 445 as the 3rd Armored Division ready to take on the crowds and show them who's boss. Question is who will win the 1st SS or yeah. the 3rd Armored Division? We shall have to see. Dun dun dun. And there we go. Starting off Engineers moving out. We should also have a swim wagon down there, of course. Will be interesting to see what it will be used for. Ice. Apparently just having a bit of ice cream. Now there we go. We see a weapon support center going up. We have some questioning in if he's good or not. That's I'm not sure, entirely sure what you're going to get out of asking that. Because, well, if you're not really going to get anything besides, alright, I'm good on... In very few cases, yes, I am bad, but that's... It really, I mean, people who are bad are just as likely to say, well, I'm great. They're also usually the types to call you a noob. Anyhow, weapon support center up, barracks up, and we see a Wehrmacht quarters up there. Nothing unusual there, and Panzer Grenadiers and three Pioneers, in fact, going out from Mr. Hideki's regiment of the 1st SS. Bit of don't be a retard. Well, again, not much you can do if you're already there, and it's generally not very polite either. I mean, it's not really going to foster a good sort of mood between the two players. You rather want to be, be diplomatic and cheerful rather than just. Anyhow, sorry for this small delay, I just had to check something out. Again, not a lot going on right here in the first few minutes, though mostly seizing territory. I'm seeing some MG42's Panzer Grenadiers now engaging right here. And of course there was some commentary on the Weapon Support Center and the fact that yes, it can work if you have some decent teamwork, so he definitely has been listening to my channel, Mr. Ice, but if again it's not necessarily the most recommendable thing, and it can easily backfire as well. So of course it is something that should be done with a bit of care. And a heavy machine gun getting caught out in the open by the Panzergrenades. This could end up badly for either side, but there we go. Panzergrenades getting gunned down, taking heavy losses and retreating right through those riflemen. Another going down, the last one barely making out of their life. While well, the heavy machine gun sets up in this very empty barn. The old empty barn. Yes, there's a story about that. But not really my point to tell it. Panzergrenade is engaging these riflemen and taking up cover inside this nice little building. Not the best position for the Panzergrenade, as you may note. Not a lot of open windows for this position. So they won't actually be able to hit really well, and there we go, further riflemen moving in. This is an you actually might end up as a death trap to those Panzergrenades if they don't get out, since they won't actually be able to fire back a lot. And there we go, Panzergrenades evacuating, 
but one is down already and left behind. So far we are seeing a bit of a broad front, but all combat forces are really being focused up here in the west. MG42 sitting up right here, hoping to cover this area and this medium fuel point. Certainly not a bad idea. And these riflemen will certainly be caught. There we go, getting suppressed. So that's certainly a bit of a lesson there. And we see the Schwimmwagen apparently halting up there. Not sure what to do. MG heavy machine gun moving out as well. And we see a bike and a sniper. So really a lot of support as well also from Mr. Hideki. So which is also what can usually happen if with if you see a Panzer Elite Commander. He will usually go for Panzer Grenadiers and the other might go for some support units. Yes, it can work, but of course... He can also backfire pretty heavily. Again, it depends on the teamwork. Riflemen hunting down this HMG-42, forcing it on the retreat. Sniper running around, not cloaked, but now getting a bit of help for that bike to provide some spotting power. Certainly not a bad idea, Riflemen getting spotted there. In fact, right out in the middle of the road. A machine gun. Having a bit of trouble with these pioneers, it seems. And bike causing a bit of harassment, finding way at these riflemen. Bike's not being usually that bad, but at this range it might not be doing too well. In fact, it barely seems to be hitting, just creating a lot of smoke plumes. And riflemen set in for the hunt. Now Panzergren is with Gewehr 40 Freeze in mass are moving in. The first SS are striking hard. And we see the sniper skulking about as well. Not really managing a lot of kills though. He seems to have a bit of stage fright. There we go. No. Yes, there we go. Finally hitting. MG40. No, we have an infantry half. Like in fact, joining up, giving a bit of mobility to those pants grenades if he so chooses it. Or he might, of course, do the slightly more silly thing and use it as an armored car and just have it a bar around instead of actually trying to use it to transport his infantry quickly to spot hotspots, which can really make quite the difference. And you can also really put a stop for engineer harassment. If they're suddenly appearing out of nowhere, half track filled to the brim with Panzer Grenadiers. So that's certainly something to keep in mind. So far, there seems to be further HMDs, heavy machine guns, or what? In fact, still a lot of support, and then plenty of Panzer Grenadiers for Mr. Squee. If no, he only seems to have three. In fact, this is a bit curious. In fact, I do believe the Americans have more units. Sniper, though, getting caught out in the open. That's a well, quite unfortunate. Schwimmwagens can detect and with a light half track nearby with a light machine gun they could easily put a quick stop to it. It looks like oh Mr. Ice has also gone for Enemy barracks, a get yeah. got a single rifleman seen. And he's getting a mortar team too as well. Quite interesting though. One of every unit except the engineers a bit curious though. Still going to be mostly a supporting force, but the rifleman can certainly protect those support units. And we're seeing machine gun emplacements going down as well to protect this area a bit. Curious though, certainly going to be fuel used there instead of, for example, a supply yard, and then perhaps who knows some motor pool action. And sniper forcing these heavy machine gunners away. Mortar getting caught though in a very nasty position. Panzerine is and half track opening up on them. And looks like the mortar team will have to get out of there before all is lost. Looks like the American effort has lost a bit of impetus and is seemingly just slowing down as one is just trying to apparently dig in but looks like cruise time is waking up again sending in a lot of riflemen with BARs and greatly increasing firepower and now we're also seeing a jeep interesting still not entirely sure what but these riflemen oh dear they are moving right into the open again heavy cover is directional as you may have noticed this direction is not offering cover and of course while well, these Panzergrenadiers didn't have the best position either, there's still the infantry half like and those Panzergrenadiers. Oh dear, this certainly looks like to just be a must of assault, and these Panzergrenadiers will have to get out there. And this infantry half like as well. Jeep now setting in with its own light machine gun, doing a bit of damage, and the half like does manage to turn around and get out of there. Mines being laid down as well. Not right here in the middle of the road, though, that would have been helpful. So far the Germans do seem to be holding this center and we see Mr. Squee going in for tank busters, Hauptmann Squee or Hauptsturmführer as it is the SS. They did have a slightly different ranking system. Quite interesting enough. And we do see a mortar half-track as well. 
And heavy machine gun opening up on these riflemen who are moving right in through this small gap which is nicely covered by this heavy machine gun right behind this wrecked truck. And this will certainly make it very difficult for those riflemen to get through. They might get easily suppressed. Yes, there we go. And Mortified joining in to really nail down those who are suppressed. And a few riflemen getting killed in the process. But the position is getting outflanked as the heavy machine gun can only be in one spot. And the mortar half tank itself can't really do much. Get up close. Sniper joining in though, Schwimmbagen with a damaged engine. Enemy unit down. And Schwimmbagen going up in flames and retreating right through those riflemen. Absolutely horrific. But German forces are securing the eastern half and I'm not entirely sure what's going on here. Apparently the motorcycle was receiving repairs. And I'm seeing four pioneer teams. That's an awful lot. Not a single infantry team in fact. Which does strike me as a bit curious as even a single Volkskrone team could certainly have been of great help. But we'll have to see. He might certainly be trying to go quickly for some taking up and going for the Panzer Command. Which is certainly not unusual if you're seeing someone who's really going for the heavy delaying stuff like lots of machine guns, pioneers and such. He's most likely trying to wait so he can get himself a tank rush of some sort. So that's usually a good thing to keep in mind. And an American mortar spirited away by pioneers. Very sneaky and certainly very resourceful and being resourceful in company feels is very is a very good trait in fact. As really putting every resource to use is generally a good thing and now we go floating a lot of manpower munitions. Not such a good thing in fact. Let's hope he actually puts it to good use. And let's go have a look at Mr. Cruise time. No doctrine either, but he's certainly not floating as much resources. Five infantry teams of the rifleman type. Very nice, very aggressive, very bold. And a trio center is only going to do his best to keep those rifleman going, going to the east. But he might want to consider getting a medic station to really decrease the amount of attrition and really keep the momentum going. I'd certainly recommend that. It's We'll have to see some slight action here in the west. Armored cars, infantry half track and mortar half tracks really putting the pressure on Mr. Ice. Captain Ice with his Jeeps, rifleman team and some other bits, heavy machine gun emplacements as well. Might get bit into a lot of trouble here. Further panzers with Gewehr 43 so everybody except those tank busters. Armored car and infantry half track hunting down here, but armored in half track is taking fire. Jeep up Bit on its own though, getting uh, fun upon from all angles, we'll need to get out of there. Americans pulling back to this small defensive line, manned by numerous machine gun emplacements, and these riflemen will have to conduct a delaying op operation until 